Hey everyone, Benji here. Welcome to my channel. Here, I talk about my journey in synthesizer DIY. In this video, I'd like to show you a simple clock divider module I made using the CD4040 binary counter chip. You can basically use it to divide clock pulses by powers of 2. Mine has 8 outputs, so the last one would divide a clock by 256. The CD4040 chip advances in the negative transition, which means that the outputs synchronize at a low signal, much like starting with a rest when dividing a whole note into quarter notes or half notes, which is weird if you want to use it to make beats. To solve this, I used some Schmidt trigger inverters to flip the outputs the right way. Now all of the outputs will be aligned at the rising edge. This makes it more musical. I also took advantage of one of the outputs of the CD4106 to make a simple clock that's normal to the clock input of the divider. This way, if I don't plug anything into the clock input, I can use the internal clock and use a knob to control the speed. I also like to use this module in the audio frequency range, so I use the pulse output of my oscillator and use the divider to add some sub-oscillators. I'll show you in the demo later. This build also uses 3D printed panels that I designed using my Euro Panel Maker library for OpenSCAD. As always, it's a point-to-point -point build. When I made it, I decided to use standard Euro Rack jacks, so I still had to use perf board. I should have used JST, but it's already there, so maybe next time. Of course, you don't have to build it like this. PCBWay has offered to sponsor this project and I'm already working on a PCB for this module. This module will be part of my mini synth series, an entire line of open source Eurorack modules that I've developed with the help of PCBWay. PCBWay is a quick and easy way to get PCB prototypes online. To get a copy of any of my existing modules from the Minisynth series, all you'd have to do is download the Gerber files from my GitHub and upload those to their order form. You can even get them in different colors. My modules are also available through PCBWay's shared project page where you can order from them directly. I'm still working on the PCB for this clock divider, so stay tuned. I'll probably post an update video. Once again, thank you very much PCBWay for supporting this project. That would be all for now. I hope this quick build log was informative somehow. Let me leave you with a jam I made featuring my clock divider module. Thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you again in the next one.